Hey, what's going on, y'all? Jimmy Macrum. It's time for episode 27 of season 5, my favorite 20 minutes of the week, The Office. Don't forget to press the like button, follow rhythm, and subscribe. Let's get to it. I just won an art contest. Ah. Oh, shit. I got her. Oh. It's an animal. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. Dwight is awful. That was kind of funny. It just was. I'm really scared. I think I'm growing into a giant because look at this normal sized coffee cup. It looks Gosh. so tiny in my giant know. hand now. At Dunder Mifflin, there is a very strict no lunch with the boss policy, and I don't know who instituted it. I think it started right after my predecessor. <laughs> is work. If you don't take out his battery, he just keeps going all day. Oh no, your battery fell out. I was just learning to <laughs> Oh, Pam might be a saint. Some guess some you hate her. Um, did somebody here leave a map in the printer to Youngstown, Ohio? Attention office, who here is planning a trip to Youngstown, Ohio? I will take your silence to mean that you're all hiding something. Oh, lying motherfuckers. Sainthood is revoked. I'm here to release frustration. Ooh. Ah, ah, ah. It's broken, so. Thank you. Come on in. Hey, hey, here we go. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Can't tell Aaron is adorable or an idiot. Or both. She might just be sweet or an idiot. When I was in charge, this place was like Dave and Buster's. People just hanging out, having fun, eating naps. I don't know, it's like Dave died or something. <laughs> I am your big daddy, and I am gonna kiss the boo boo. Little Andy is a way. Oh my god. To meet, to greet, to see the ones that you love, to love the ones that you see. Is this our punishment for not wanting to have lunch with you? <laughs> Why don't you get over lunch, Oscar? Everybody else is past it. All work and no play makes Michael a dull boy. This is like a haunted That's coffee good. house? No. Like a disco cafe. What? No. No. Not even close. <laughs> I can't force you to go down, but I can entice you. Well said. Come. Kevin, stay. Kevin, come. Kevin. Stay. Kevin, come. Stay, stay. Come on, right Cookie, now. Cookie, Kevin. Cookie. <laughs> there is. Come on. Oh, for goodness sakes, Kevin. There's no cookie. There's no cookie. Come on. Come. Here we go. Don't stop. Hi, Jessica, it's Bobby. Oh, he's on a call. Oh, I'll just stuck my head in. It's pretty important. He wouldn't want to be disturbed. Uh, can I give him a message before he gets oh, off? Oh, shit. I'd be concerned. I mean, looks just like you. Younger. <laughs> you sound a little more excited. There you go. You got it. What? Ooh, show me some attitude. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. I got your text. Who's Philip? No, no, no. Who tipped you over? Was it Philip? What? It's my back. It's your back. We just. Who's Philip? Okay, good. I do not want anybody to worry. What happened to Phyllis? Oh, you know, nothing. She's. We were hanging out at Cafe Disco and she had a flare up of an existing injury, but she's still full of her. Can you please trade that memory for anything? And I would like the memory of a day uninterrupted by this nonsense. You all took a life here today. <laughs> you did. The what? life of the party. Why? Fuck? Why? Come on, relax. The shirt wasn't doing you any favors. <laughs> if my assessment is correct, you grind your teeth? I do. Holy shit. No kidding. She sits three feet from me. It's the most annoying oh. thing. Uh, uh. 
It's like children singing Christmas oh, carols. How do you know that? Cafe Disco is dead, but I can still hear the music in my head. I hear it too, boss. Oh, this is sh strangely sweet. My grandfather was told that Diamond Dancer would never race again. They were wrong. He came in ninth in the Apple Creek Derby. And his jerky... <laughs> A fucking horse, that's perfect. Look, I hate to be a bad person, but I just don't like the general spirit of music. I know, I know. The general Angela, spirit of, of music? Doubted Cafe Disco at what? First. Now I need you to lie still for an hour. An hour? I, I can't stay here an hour. Oh, get... whoa, whoa, girl. Whoa, whoa. Boss. <laughs> Windshield, but it belongs in here. Hey, thank you, Creed. You really got this place. No problem. I'll just have no idea who's driving behind me now. Puts me to sleep. I think Bob's gonna cheat on me with his new secretary. Jesus. Not so funny. When I say it out loud, it it's so silly. <laughs> I forgot about Stanley. I should probably stop by. I didn't want to. Wanna dance, Dwight? Ordinarily, I would say no, but you need to move to reduce lactic acid buildup. Also, the song is fantastic. Mind if I uh, steal my wife? You can't steal what is legally your property. <laughs> <laughs> Put on a t-shirt. I think maybe I want a wedding. Wedding. Me too. Really? Yeah. Oh, that was adorable. Yeah. Be brave. I know, but you're not a professional, and I'm thinking maybe we should have gone. I'm doing no. I'm doing it for free. Just you have to stop squirming, otherwise I'm gonna mess up. Are you sure, sure that's not the gate ear? Gate ear? Are you 12 years old? <laughs> Look, I'm gonna count to two, three. That was son of a bitch! Andy, that was just the ice. <laughs> it was. Yeah, it was. <laughs> All right, that was episode 27 of season five of The Office. We're almost done. That was the penultimate episode of season five. Where to begin? Oh, good episode. I enjoyed it. I can't go great like I have for the last few, but it was a good episode. It was even more of a change of pace um, with this being one of the more silly episodes, we'll say. I... Um, I thought we'd found a nice balance. Uh, and maybe not even nice balance, maybe a little strong. <laughs> I'm BSing around. I like the fact that we didn't get a lot of Jim and Pam together. Uh, the back half of the season in particular. And then this episode, we were back at it. And I gotta be honest, I'm not thrilled. <laughs> I'm not thrilled. Um, turning the dumbness of Kevin up to uh, even further levels. I thought the chili thing was ridiculous. This thinking there's a cookie in Michael's hand might be more ridiculous. Though, I gotta be honest, I enjoyed it. I found that funny. I don't know why. Maybe it's it's the way people... Oh, you know what? You know what? In the chili scene, there's nobody reacting to Kevin. It's just Kevin. Like, the two times I've enjoyed Kevin, one was this one. <laughs> as Angela is so baffled um, by this. And the other was... Shit. I just had it and I lost it. The other was... Oh! With, um... What was her name? Um, Michael's girlfriend. Holly. Was Holly thinking he is slow? Medically. <laughs> that was also funny. So you know what? When it's kept in that context... I do get a kick out of it. It's just when we stray from that. Um, I assume we're going to get a Pam and Jim wedding. I don't know if that's coming up next or next season, but I assume it's going to happen. 
That's why I was rather shocked when they said they were going to do it in Delaware or New Hampshire. Where the fuck they said they were going? We're going to get it. To be fair, the last wedding was fucking hilarious, so this could be funny too. I don't know. Um, post your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe.